What's up guys, Shedding Star here today. Just bring you a quick video. Um Well loads of people wanna do like that nose blunt glitch. Right here um I've got my skate here and my brother's PS3. Um and loads of people wanna learn how oh my god I've still I've still a regular Oh this sucks, I hate regular. Um anyway so I'm gonna show you how to do like um nose blunt. So I'll show you how to do it first on me. So here's what you here's what it should look like. That's not how it should look. Hang on a minute, guys, and I'll show you how to do it on regular with a hand cam. I'm not doing it. Oh yeah, obviously because I'm doing it the wrong way. Alright, there's a nose blunt. So what you need to do is here's my controller. You push and you've got to do that and you've got to slightly tilt your um thing. So you've got to jump and then you've got to do this almost. Look really, really slow. And when you do that it should look like this. You can see the screen hopefully. I'll move it that way so you can actually see the tricks. Oh, no. I can't do it now. There we go, okay. Now, guys, I'm going to show you how to do it on Goofy. So, you basically do exactly the same thing, except you've just got to, um, yeah, you've just got to basically, yeah, by the way, um, oh, flipped, okay. So, um, basically, this is going to be like, um, hang on, let me just turn all this off. So to do on the other way, let's go to career real quick on my brother's skater, there it is. And then we'll go edit skater. We need to go to me, edit skater, and we'll put on Goofy because that is my style. Um, yeah, it's, it's Goofy, cool. So, I should be getting Goofy now. If I go, so let's go to free play again. Um, Connor. I'm still not goofy. Oh, my legs are back as well. Oh, that won't that won't affect my skater at all. Um, um. We're going to need a way we can change its style. So let's go to Rory Skater actually. We can see if we can actually change the style on this because we need it goofy. So now we can skate goofy and then we'll change it back to Rory because he skates regular, which I think is really rubbish because goofy OP. Oh, anyway, so we're not in goofy. We're not in goofy. What? So, oh wait, hang on a minute. No, wait, we are in Goofy now. Okay, so we're in Goofy now. So basically, instead, you just gotta do it the other way. So instead of um, doing it to the. Um, what did I do it? You just gotta do it. With Goofy, I like to do it. Um, if your rail is facing this way, then you've got to do it like. Um, let's show. Uh, so you've got to put the stick left. If, you, if your rail's on. This, this is weird. Okay, so if your rail is on the left side of your skater, you got to put the stick right. And if the rail is on the left side of your skater, you've got to turn it left. And I promise, I promise you that does work. So let's on this side, I'll put the stick. I'll put the stick left. No, wait. Oh no, if the I I've got it the wrong way, I think. So. Uh, Oh, my brother skates regular. It's impossible. Oh, so guys, you can figure that out. You know, just put the stick slightly to the um, 
left or whatever and um yeah just keep practicing that and you should get it at some point so <laughs> i really need this um no i need this stuff to be goofy so let's go into an online match and we will see how this glitch works in action and you probably everyone already knows where we do this so you do it in skate and you you do it in campus skate hopefully this match i've just randomly joined is in campus skate um, let's actually take my mic out because i don't want that in while i'm recording so let's do that and um let's just record this so we're not in the place I wanted to go in but you should be able to get some good grinds um, these guys don't look like they start but oh well you can get some good tricks at least um, I might even record a few games of skate with this tutorial um, so let's go and let's no, we need to quit the session. Um, I'll get. I'll see you in a match. Okay, guys. So we should be loading into a mat on the campus escape right now. Um. So here we go. We should be in it, and we will be able to record. And I flipped it again. Okay, so here we are. We're not. Um, are we goofy now? Our oh, boys. I think we're goofy. Let me just check with this glitch. No, we're goofy. Sick. Okay. So what you need to do, if you're regular, then obviously you do it this way, and you've got to do it the other way. You know, you can't. You can, or you can do it still if you're on goofy, but it doesn't work there. So you do it on regular on the left side, and if you're on goofy, which I am, you do it on this side. So with this side, you've got to do it. Um, you got obviously ollie, and then shift your stick to the left to do the speed glitch not the right and um, once you got it perfected though it should look like this and you can get some really good tricks in there um, maybe not grabs because you're not allowed grabs but maybe if you can get enough height without like jumping you might be able to do like a back foot because I know no one can do them like hardly anyone <laughs> because you can't you can't ollie back foot or it'll count as an ollie you need to like get air by yourself and it, that that would count as an that would count as an ollie. You just gotta do the speed glitch, and you basically just gotta get like height like this, where you can just go backward. There we go, nothing, nothing after it. Also, while I'm here, I may as well show another glitch. Um, everyone probably knows what the glitch is. This is called the ramp glitch. Everyone knows it. Um, we'll do it in two different locations. Um, one of them is here. Well, basically you've got to set your marker and you can do it there let's go to a different location and let's do it so yeah boopie doo we might as well record this so you, the best place to practice is to go to um, locations university district i think it is anyway and you do campus entrance so you're now here and you can do this and that whole way to the clock ha clock tower is just exploration ground um, so for this glitch you will want to set your marker not that close but on your board I prefer you get off your board you hold R1 or RB and you run at the wall then when you get to the wall you get let go of um, RB or R1 and you've got to press triangle and get on your board so it should look a little bit like this let me do it real quick that's a little one let me try on a different one let me try on this big one 
There we go. That was the best one. So once you've got that, you can start adding in late flips and flips and flips and more flips and shove it. I'll try and do a quad shove it. Oh, that would be cool. It's really hard to do quad shove it because late shove it's going to like so slow. Anyway, another place where you can do this. I know is in the clock tower. I can't personally do it here. I don't believe I can anyway. Um, but you can do it on the edge of the clock, I believe. If you look at Duck Voice, I think it is, he does all glitches and you'll be able to see he does it here. Um, he just sets his marker like this and just goes, bosh. And he goes, oh, I'm not actually able to do it. Yay! Woohoo! That was so cool. I think you need to like foot plant land it. Should I try landing a foot plant? That's what I think we need to do. I can't set a mark without being on my board. Let's just. <laughs> that was incredible one ago anyway so um thank you for watching this video if you liked it put a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel because i'm epic okay